Hola amigos, welcome to my first vlog. Um, I wanted to take the time to talk about the class of 2020. Now, I know, I know, you guys have been waiting for, you guys have been waiting for this special day for a very, very long time. And I know it didn't go the way you guys planned it. But, you know, what matters is you guys are done with high school. And for some of you, you might be going to college. Well, I've been told that college isn't for everyone. But here's the thing. If you think college isn't for you, Go to college and honestly get what you know, meet people, become friends with them to help you along, you know. Um, like when, when you go schedule your classes, make sure that you don't. Don't schedule any classes at night. Not a good idea. If if you like sleep, if you enjoy sleeping, and you get tired in the nighttime, suggestion: don't take night classes. Another another um, another tip: make sure that you study before you be before. You, before you go to parties. Now, now, if you already um, finished school for the week and it's a holiday that week, then you can totally go and party. Just make sure you don't have any due dates coming up. And... Also, when scheduling classes, you need to make sure you give yourself enough time to go from point A to point B, class one to class two to class three. Um, suggestion, try to schedule two classes a day, have two classes per day, and... Um, if you guys don't really like going to school on Fridays, just schedule Monday through Thursday. And if you want to work during college, take the weekend. Just make sure you're able to manage your study time and don't get stressed because you're working and everything. But make sure you have really good teachers too because that's another thing like you won't really pass a class if one you don't have a teacher that that's willing to help you and there are a lot of teachers that are willing to help students but you have to show them that you want the grade you have to show them that you are capable of getting an A, that you are capable of getting a B. Don't show them that you are just a C student. Don't show them that you don't care about school and you only get D's and F's. Honestly, you really have to think about this. Like, it's... It's not easy. Um, 
Now, one of one of my favorite YouTubers, his his channel is um, Emergency, and his name is Rumi. He goes to um, he goes to a um a university in in uh, Washington, I D.C. Washington DC. I don't exactly remember the um or maybe it was Washington State. But anyway, I don't exactly remember the name of the college. But with the times we have now all college students are at home. So another thing since your guys' first semester will be online tips would be like so if you don't get up early if you don't get up till 11 a.m don't schedule a class before 11 a.m that's not smart definitely not smart okay now you want to, and don't schedule a class during lunch time. Because one thing you don't want to do is distract others. But since you're home, I guess it's okay. But honestly, don't do it. I'd rather you guys focus than eat. You can't. Focus on the teacher and eat at the same time. It does not work that way at all. So, that's pretty much what you guys have to, have to do for, for college. Um, now... Like I said, the YouTuber that I like viewing is channels called Emergency, and he has a video on there. If you watched my last video, I um I added his vi uh video to to the end in case you wanted to watch it. View his channel, give him subscribers, and while you're at it, give me subscribers too. If you're new. Yay! Anyway, um, that's very important. And just remember, study before you go and party. If you just want to go to college just to party and get drunk, then there's no way you're going to pass your classes. There's no way you're going to get anything done. And make sure you guys stay organized. Print your syllabuses. Your, uh, print your syllabi. And print your course calendars. Literally. The course calendars are essential. Because it tells you exactly. Step by step. What's to what what you have to do what's required and make sure you stay on top of your instructor's announcements and read over the syllabi because it tells you exactly how you're graded how your grades are and if you don't understand something and you want to improve ask questions as long as it's not in the syllab syllabus. So, if your questions aren't part of the syllabi, then you can ask them. But, if you're able to find the answer in the syllabus, don't email your instructor. Because they have a lot of work to do. They're just like teachers in high school, except they're more willing to help you pass.
So, class of 2020, congrats, congrats, congrats on completing high school. Good luck in college. Remember all the tips I gave you. And if you want to see what um, first week of college is really like, <sighs> Rumi does a really good job. Love his channel. He, like, really puts a light into college. And he literally helped me out in my first... He helped me along. And, yeah, things were pretty great. So, um, like, comment, subscribe. And enjoy college. Bye.